It's 11 breads today. We tried something today called, we're calling it masa salvada con cage Saint George. Um, so we, we took the sweet and the savory and put it together. Every evening for coffee service, we have something called Corona Dolce, which is a sweeter bread with a hint of anise, with these crunchy little sugar pearls on top that we all really like. But for the savory breads, we always start with a multigrain. It has a cereal blend. It has natural leavening. Um, it's been very popular. We use a little bit of the Azorian honey to take the edge off of that sour, so it's more of a Portuguese flavor. Uh, we make something called Dutch Crunch, which is a, a soft white bread with a crunchy topping made from rice flour. Uh, we have a scone that we use Cage Saint George all the time too, with caramelized onions and the cheese, so it's a savory scone. It's, it's been very popular. We make pretzel every day, so we, we make the dough in the traditional German way, dip it in the lye, which is very strong, gives it the characteristic flavor. We're making focaccia every day with rosemary and the flor de sel from Portugal. It's a challenge, and those challenges, you know, normally in a bakery, especially for me as a baking instructor, you mix the dough, you let it rest one hour, you fold it, or you manipulate it, then you wait another hour, precisely, and you're in a controlled environment, and then you wait 30 minutes and you take another step and another step. This is not like that. We're carrying the bread back and forth, so when these chefs want things,